how we define ourselves, what we think is our true personality, is actually mainly a compendium, a group of tendencies and behaviors we've adopted mainly unconsciously throughout our lives. Now, if we want to deliberately and consciously program more confidence, tenaciousness, fearlessness into our personalities in order to get more of what we want in life and to reach our goals, the fastest, most effective way to do that is to associate into a very strong archetype or representative of these behaviors. Simply put, we can build in and build up an inner boxing champion, an inner lion, that instantly and immediately pops into our consciousness whenever we need. It just becomes a real part of our personality. Now, a lion has a fearless presence, movements, and behavior, something that others can physically sense as you imagine yourself as a lion and take on the mindset of a lion. A champion boxer is crafty, tenacious, takes opportunities, gives punches, but is unfazed by taking punishment. A champion gets up when others stay down. Now, no matter if you're male or female, I'm sure you can think of areas in your own life where you would like to increase your daring, confidence, perseverance, and overall winning mindset. So please make sure now that you're either comfortably sitting down or laying down. Just get into a comfortable position where you can remain still for this entire session. And just please make sure all distractions are off and put aside now. And just begin to focus solely on my voice. Hypnosis is really just sustained attention on one thing. My voice can guide you. So as you follow my words, just let all else just naturally fade and blur into the background. It's as if you were holding a magnifying glass to my spoken words and you just keep your attention fixed on these words while letting all else go. You can just let your thoughts drift. You have decided to take the time to program some new behaviors into your mind and personality. And this is the perfect time and the ideal place. So just let your whole body relax now. Just imagine all the muscles and tendons of your body. And just let all the muscles and tendons of your body grow loose and limp. Just give your body the suggestion now to really relax. And as you scan your body, notice that it does relax. And we're just going to take a slow, deep breath in together. And when you exhale, just notice that your body relaxes down even deeper. Inhale. And exhale. Scan your body and notice that you've relaxed even deeper. That extra oxygen just allows your mind and body to calm. And let's just take another 
slow, deep breath in together. Inhale. And exhale. Just relaxing down. Whole body going deeper. And as your body relaxes, your mind will relax. Your conscious mind is not necessary on this journey because we want to speak directly to the subconscious mind. So just let your thoughts drift and just follow my voice. Your conscious thoughts may pass in and out like clouds through a blue sky. Hypnosis or going into trance just feels good. Hypnosis is a feel-good state. And the deeper you go, the better you feel. And the better you feel, the deeper you can go. Deep relaxation of the body just releases endorphins. Your body's feel-good chemical. And you can always go more deeply relaxed by just allowing it. It's a matter of just accepting and allowing it by just letting go and giving in to deep relaxation. Just feel a particularly pleasant feeling and follow that down. Just feel an inner tug and follow that down, letting go and giving in to your own good feelings as you allow the relaxation you become the relaxation you could just imagine a numbing anesthesia a wonderful sleepy feeling just imagine it rises up from your feet and ankles, completely relaxing your feet and ankles. Just feel your feet and ankles wonderfully relaxed. And it spreads to your lower legs and upper legs. Completely relaxing your lower legs and upper legs. Just notice your legs relaxing completely. Now allow it to spread up to your hips and stomach. And as you gently breathe in and out, just notice your lower abdomen completely relaxing. Imagine that wonderful anesthesia spread like a warm energy from your lower abdomen to your entire upper body. Just completely relaxing your entire upper body like throwing on a warm blanket. And the beautiful, warm, relaxing energy just spreads up to your head, completely relaxing your head, your whole body now, just full of warm, relaxing energy. 
it just feels so good to just relax down deeper into this pleasant, wonderful, relaxed state. It just feels so wonderful and ideal now as you follow my voice as I guide you deeper. And you can go much deeper. I am going to count from five down to one. Just imagine that you've doubled the level of relaxation that you now feel. By the time I reach the count of one, just double the level of relaxation you presently feel in your body. Five. Starting to double your level of relaxation. Four. Doubling more and more. Three. Just letting go and really allowing the relaxation because it feels good and because all relaxation is for your positive benefit. Two. Almost doubled your level of relaxation. And one. Just imagine and feel in your body that your relaxation has now doubled. Feel the tug and follow it down. Down to a wonderful, comfortable, relaxed state. Just let your thoughts drift. Just let your mind clear. Your mind relaxes as your body has relaxed and your body has doubled its level of relaxation. Feel your body warm and heavy. And each breath you take just sends you deeper. And each word I say just somehow compels you deeper. And your body is relaxed and drifting down deeper. Just feeling a very pleasant feeling and following that down. Now just imagine you are standing in front of a whiteboard and in your hand is a marking pen. Now imagine that on that whiteboard you have just written a large number 100. Just imagine a large number 100 on the whiteboard. And now imagine that you've just erased the number 100. Just allowing your mind to sink down deeper into this wonderful, comfortable, relaxed state. Deeper and deeper now. Really letting go. And now imagine that you've just written the number 99 on the whiteboard. A nice number 99 on the whiteboard. And now imagine that you've just erased that number 99. Going, going gone. As you feel a tug and just following that down. Just letting go giving in to your own good feelings. Your body and mind appreciate that you've taken this time to really relax and rejuvenate. And now imagine that you've just written the number 98 on the whiteboard. A big number 98. And now imagine you've just erased the number 98, 
and you just go so deep now, and your mind just relaxes, and your body relaxes, and your mind and body just keep drifting down deeper. Now just imagine that you've written the number 97 on the whiteboard. A number 97. Now just erase the number. Let it fade. Let it disappear as you just float down into a beautiful, calm, deep state. Now it just may be too troublesome to keep imagining all these numbers. It's just starting to be too much effort. Nevertheless, let's try. Try to imagine writing the number 96. See yourself slowly managing to scrawl an almost illegible number 96 on the whiteboard and just now let it disappear letting all the numbers the counting and the whiteboard disappear pushing it out of your mind the only thing that is important now is how good you feel and as you drift with each and every word i say it just sends you deeper. With each word I say, it just becomes your new compelling reality. As everything I say becomes your positive new thought pattern. Now just imagine a strong lion. Just visualize a lion. See a majestic strong lion. You are the lion. See the majestic lion. This brave, sublime, powerful lion is you. And just sense your strength. Your roar is loud. It makes all other animals quake. Your territory is vast. Life expands according to your courage, which is in great supply. You now begin to channel the lion, and we use the lion's strength in every part of your life that you choose. You are the lion. In any area of your life, you can just walk, talk, act, as you become the lion. You will merge with the lion. See the majestic lion. Strength is in your presence. Strength is in your presence. Strength is in your presence. Even as you can stand perfectly with a smile on your face, you are aware of your inner lion's strength. You are the lion. Your inner roar comes out in your presence. The lion is as brave as it needs to be. It does not look for trouble, but can stand alone and does not retreat. A lion does not have to prove that it's a threat. People already sense your power. People sense your deep confidence that is the heart of a lion. You are the lion. And just imagine now how you hold yourself, your gestures, how you would stand, how you would move as you become the lion. Notice the strength in your very presence. Feel your nervous system, feel your blood as you take on the lion. You channel the lion. 
You become the lion. You are the lion. You are the lion. A lion doesn't care if a monkey is laughing at him. A lion doesn't care if a monkey is laughing at him. A lion doesn't care if a monkey is laughing at him. A lion is not perturbed by small things. Fools are nothing to him. A lion doesn't concern himself with the opinion of sheep. When a chihuahua barks, a lion doesn't even bother turning around. Throughout the day, you are walking with the heart of a lion. You stay in the center of your own circle and let things run their course. Your strength is in your presence. Your strength is in your peace when everyone else runs. On the inside, you roar like a lion. On the outside, you live inspired, confident, and free. You stand alone like a lion and live your life according to your own light. You stand alone like a lion and live your life according to your own light. You stand alone like a lion and live your life according to your own light. To be a lion, you run with lions and act like lions. As you walk and act channeling the lion, people automatically assume that you are a lion. As you roar, your heart is kind, your mind is fierce, your spirit is brave. The scars you bear are the scars of a competitor. You are imperturbable. You are the lion. You are the lion. You spring into action when needed. And woe be unto them that mistakenly doubt your courage. Woe be unto them who test your resolve. You stand strong and live your life according to your own light. And just let your whole body relax down now. Just let your thoughts drift and just go deeper. It just feels so good to let your mind clear. It just feels so good to focus on my voice as each and every word I say just sends you deeper. Just follow my words and allow your body to relax still deeper. And I'm going to count from five down to one. And at one, you will just double again your level of relaxation that you now feel. By the time I reach the count of one, just imagine your entire body has doubled its relaxation. Five, one step down into relaxation, beginning to double your level of relaxation. Four, doubling more and more. Just feel the feeling and follow that down. Three, it just feels so good to just really allow your mind and body to completely relax down now. Two, almost doubled your level of relaxation. One, 
doubling the level of relaxation. Just imagine that you have doubled again your level of relaxation. And you just continue to go deeper. With each breath you take, you just go deeper. With each word I say, you just allow yourself to drift down deeper into this wonderful, comfortable, relaxed state. Hypnosis just feels good. As your mind and body enjoy your communication and attention, and your subconscious mind enjoys assisting you to make positive changes that allow you to reach all the goals in your life. And that just each and every word I say now become your positive new reality. As everything I say becomes your positive new thought pattern. You are now a boxer. You are a champ. You exude confidence. You just assume that you are a champion. You give yourself every possible chance. You are a winner. You take every opportunity. You are now a boxer. In the ring or in any other area of your life that you choose, you can channel your inner champion boxer. Be it in work, sports, school, social life, in any situation you find yourself wanting perseverance and confidence of a champion boxer. You are a champ. You are way past doubts. You left doubts and negative thinking aside long ago. You are way past doubts. You left doubts and negative thinking aside long ago. You are way past doubts. You left doubts and negative thinking aside long ago. You know that this game is 90% mental, so you don't leave your thoughts going in random directions. You are a winner. You can't wait to wake up every day and take on a new challenge. Only champion thoughts serve you. You are a winner, and you feel that running through your blood. You just assume that you are a champion, and let the universe pull you up to that level. You are eager in the morning to get in the ring to show your dominance. You spar with the toughest guys, knowing that training with the tough guys is what's going to make you better. You know that it's not about how hard you hit, but how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. You know that it's not about how hard you hit, but how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. You know that it's not about how hard you hit, but how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. You are a champ. You exude confidence. Giving up is not in your blood. You dominate your emotions. You remain calm and stay in control. You know how the game is played. You step away from any punches heading your way. But you know that getting hit is just part of it. If at first you don't succeed, you call it round one. Life doesn't run away from anyone. Life runs at people. And you can't wait. You are a winner. You can't wait to wake up every day 
and take on a new challenge. You quietly will your confidence into being at any moment. You can grind and push and look for open doors. You rebound quickly from mistakes and convert them into learning and confidence. A champion boxer gets up when he can't. A champion boxer gets up when he can't. A champion boxer gets up when he can't. Pain is acceptable. Falling is acceptable. Quitting is not. Fear is your best friend. It's not the size of the person, but the size of the heart that matters. You know that defeat is not declared if you fall, but if you refuse to stand up again. Everyone has a plan until they get punched in the face. That's where the weak shrivel away, but you simply punch back because you have boxing instincts and for you, life is a game. Your confidence is strong because you keep it that way. You cultivate confidence with constant confident thoughts and words. Now in a moment, I'm going to count from one up to five. And at five, just open your eyes, feeling confident, tenacious, and ready to win. One, two, three, four, and five. Open your eyes, feeling very confident, feeling very tenacious, and ready to win. 